A Huntington woman is getting nearly $2 million in back child support after finding out her dead husband is alive. News Channel 15's Katra Pessoa has more on this wild case. So, Katra, what do you know? Well, Linda Eisler is happy that she'll be getting child support money from her long-lost husband, but has no words, just a whirlwind of emotions over everything that's happened over the last two decades. It's 1993 in Hamilton County, Indiana, and Linda Eisler's husband, Richard Hoagland, has suddenly disappeared, wallet left behind. Years go by without a word from him, and the devastated family assumes he's dead, even declaring it official with the county. But then, two years ago, Eisler received the most shocking phone call of her life from police in Florida. She was driving a pickup truck along the road and she got the cell phone call and when they told her that she had to drive completely off the road and stop the car and take a lot of deep breaths. Her husband was alive and had been living with a fake identity. You're dealing with human lives that for 20 years their reality has just been shattered. Eisler's attorney Thomas Markle says after Hoagland had abandoned the family, he fled to Ohio. He stole the identity of his friend's son who had just died from drowning. Under his new name, Terry Siminski, he moved to Florida. He even remarried and had another child. But then two years ago, Siminski, or Hoagland rather, was busted for identity theft. He went to prison, but as soon as he got out, Eisler was waiting to take him to court for back child support. I mean, since it's the first time she's seen him face to face last Thursday, I mean, obviously very emotional. I think she's happy with the amount of the award. She was awarded $2 million. Hoagland's two sons are bitter and want nothing to do with him. As for Hoagland himself, the only reason he gave for abandoning his family he wanted to get away. Eisler's attorney isn't sure if Hoagland will be able to pay the entire $2 million in child support. They do know he owns multiple planes and multiple properties, but at the same time, he's going through his third divorce, so they'll have to see. Kaitor Pessoa, News Channel 15.